Hi everyone, it's Jasmine here and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, we're going to be making a pandan Swiss roll. This is actually one of my mom's favorite desserts and that's why I'm making it today. If you're interested in making this as well, just keep on watching. So for the first part, you're going to need two eggs and one egg yolk. One third cup of white sugar. And one tablespoon of honey. And then in a bowl, you're going to mix all three of them together. I just realized that you could have put all the ingredients straight to the bowl. I guess it's just more washing for me at the end. So I've just set up a double boiler here, I've got the saucepan at the bottom and I just put a little bit of water and let it simmer as well and then put the bowl on top of it. So we're just going to continue mixing this until the mixture feels warm to touch. I guess what I mean is that if you put your finger in, you should be able to hold it in without pulling away. Mine is ready so I'm going to set it aside. So straight after that, we're going to beat the egg mixture until it is foamy. So you'll notice that the mixture is going to light up in color as well. Now I have here one half cup or 60 grams of cake flour. You can also use all-purpose flour. To that I'm just adding one half teaspoon of salt and one tablespoon of powdered milk. Now I'm going to add all of this into the egg mixture. So we're carefully folding in our dry ingredients into the egg mixture. So we're doing this because we don't want to knock out all the air that we've just created a while ago. Now it's time to flavor the cake. We're gonna put half a teaspoon of pandan extract and half a teaspoon of pandan food coloring. We're also going to put 25 grams of melted butter. And once again, we're gonna gently stir it until all the flavorings are fully combined.
So now we're gonna transfer this into a tray. I'm just lining mine with the baking paper. Now this has to go to the oven for about 15 minutes at 180 C. I've just taken this out of the oven and I'm going to let it cool down before we put the whipped cream on top. So now that it is nice and cooled down, I'm just, I've decided to trim the edges as well, just to make it beautiful. You don't have to do this, I just like to keep it tidy. So now we're going to make our whipped cream. I have here 250 ml of thickened cream and to that I added one third cup of icing sugar. And I'm just gonna give it a little mix. Once again guys, I could have just put it straight to this bowl. I don't know what's happening to me that day. I was probably too keen to wash the dishes. So we're just going to whisk this one until it is nice and thick. So we're just waiting for it to have a body, so it should be able to hold itself up. But we absolutely cannot over mix this because this is going to turn into butter. And we don't need butter. So now using a spatula, we are going to spread the whipped cream on the cake. I decided to use a smaller spatula because it's so much easier to use. So now we have to roll the cake. Take your time with this guys and make sure that you do not apply too much pressure while doing it. Now we have to cling wrap this and we have to put it in the fridge to cool down for at least an hour. So now I've taken this out of the fridge and I think it's ready to be served.
Now guys, I forgot to take a video of the finished product, but I took a couple of photos and here they are. Since we're giving this to mom, I am going to make her coffee as well. Done, so I'm just going to give the cake to mom now and we'll see what she thinks about it. I hope she likes it and I hope that you don't mind her taking over my channel for a little bit. Yum, set up Ate. And that's a hitch. Oh, this is my favorite. Kenji. It's pandan flavor and it brings back all the memories back way then. Yum. What's this? Coffee? Coffee. Goes with the coffee as well. And um, thank you, Ate. Love you. Love By you. the way, before I forget, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel of Ate Jazz. It's like Jazz for Tips, your YouTube name. And um, please don't forget to hit like. Please subscribe. Thank you so much. Bye. Thanks, me. Bye. Thank you. Bye.